For three days now, 69-year-old Juan Romero has been guarding his small jewelry shop. He hasn't left that store on busy Lincoln Avenue because what happened to him this weekend isn't a first. One, two, three, four, about five times at least. That's how many times he's been broken into. Juan started Azteca Jewelry back in 1977. Sunday night, he was inside when the looting he'd watched on TV wound up on his front door. Bam! A noise, big noise. They crushed the, the windows. So, and then I said, uh oh. Juan didn't think twice. He says he confronted three looters while holding on to his weapon. They crashed the two windows, the front windows. So, but they didn't, they have no chance. Why do you say they had no chance? Because I didn't give him no chance. Because I screamed, you know, real bad words. He was lucky it worked. All three ran off. Juan's neighbors are still going through the video, but they shared with us some of the images from other nights captured over the last few days. You could see vehicles that were passing by multiple times, driving slowly, um, sometimes more than one vehicle together. Looters hit the target in a string of other places. It has everybody on the normally quiet strip on edge, but it has brought them together. In fact, neighbors were the ones who helped Juan clean up. I didn't realize he was in there till after I got down uh, down here and and he was actually pretty calm I have to say uh, for having having gone through that experience. Yeah and one of the neighboring businesses actually captured some pretty good shots some pretty good video they're going to turn that over to Juan and then police. Meanwhile things have started to calm down on that strip of Lincoln and Addison but just this morning a uh, business called Uncle Dan's in Lakeview was broken into mm. so it seems like it's not quite over yet yeah. but uh, you do see a lot of the businesses right there uh, starting to open up and uh, letting go of those uh, yeah. boarded windows. That's yeah. good to hear. Mm -hmm.